Well, let's bring in Jay Cruz first, okay. first of all. Okay. First of all, I was going to go into it myself, but we have we have an expert on the scene. So far be it from me to steal the thunder from entertainment news with Jay Cruz. Hey, Jay Cruz, good to see you this morning. I ain't gonna lie, you guys were on fire on the topics. I was watching. I'm sitting here watching like, wow, this show is great. Dang, they are good. And did you know that Kanye West had a Sunday service? By the way, we're speaking of churches and people being allowed into churches. This is outdoors, yeah. so I guess you couldn't restrict it anyway. But um, have you seen it? Have you watched? I mean, most people, I, I would say, have seen the big gatherings that he holds as a Sunday service. He, Most of them in California, but he had another one recently. But he's catching some backlash this time because not only was Justin Bieber there dressed in all white, everybody was dressed in off-white, sorry. Well, it was more like a all-white. Um, Marlon Manson was there, and that's where he's catching the backlash. As we all know, two actresses have accused him of sexually and physically assaulting them. So a lot of people are coming at him. And during the video, if you watch it, like, they had a moment where Kanye and Marilyn hug, and you could tell that they're upset, like weeping, I would say, even crying. Um, but, you know, it's an ongoing investigation. He could still be found guilty. So a lot of people are yeah. just criticizing Kanye for having him there specifically, you know? And this... I don't know, are people are allowed a second chance? You know, people are allowed to try to change and all that. And if this gathering helps Marlon become a better person. I'm all for it. I can't, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to go out of my way to criticize it because people who need help should be at things like this. Yeah, I see what you're saying. It's like, if not church, then where, right? If, 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 exactly. If, if where else can he get help? This is somewhere he's people supposed to. showed up at right. church, there is no church. There they is no place right. to go. So They wouldn't have to worry about this amendment right. limiting religious right. gatherings. None of us would be there because right. none of us are perfect. So, so that is, so there's that. Mm -hmm. I think yeah, the problem the with this yeah. one is it almost seemed like Kanye was elevating him. I don't know. I struggle with even my own, you know, verbiage on this right. because no. none of us should be elevated because we are, you know, we are all sinners if you, you know, are a Christian person. But it's it's not the first time he had him just, on. He had him on. He performed it at the stadium recently for the album release. So, so and, uh, and so there's have a they had that. Has Kanye West and Marilyn Manson had this ongoing, I didn't know, relationship, professional relationship, friendship? I, I hadn't heard boo of Marilyn Manson in a very long time until these accusations came out. I, to me, it's more like the controversy. Like, who could you bring out that's going to cause some controversy? And it was Marilyn Manson the first and time when he came out. About it. And, yeah. that's and now it might be deeper. Sure. You know, he's got issues. Kanye's in his ear. Like, you know, I found God. You can, too. Now, there's also a rumor that he has a Nazi tattoo. So it just, it's gone, you know, it's going further and further. But Kanye is unfazed. He is standing by his, you know, he's standing by his decision to have him there. He's generally unfazed, I think, right? I mean, he just always moves forward <laughs> through every controversy. Um, you he know, also shaved his eyebrows. I'm sorry, I had to throw that in there. He shaved his eyebrows. Just throw it out there. Oh, you should have done that yes. for your costume, Rob. No, I just put the, the Elmer's glue over them. Yeah, and just that was right a down. fashion um, tip you could have taken. So, Jay Cruz, I remember back in the day, I mean, this was sort of... Um, Almost after the Osbournes came, the newlyweds, Nick Lachey, Jessica Simpson, MTV, yeah. circa 2002. Um, really, it was it was it was reality television. We saw a side of Jessica Simpson we hadn't seen. Nick Lachey has moved on from that relationship. Jessica right. Simpson has come out with that photo yesterday, acknowledging her battle with alcoholism. Now comes a book, Nick Lachey yeah. saying he'll never read it. I mean, I don't know. Was it necessary for him to comment, or I guess he was asked? Well, here's the thing. The book's been out. It came out in February oh, of 2020. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's called Open Book. Clearly, so he I'm was recently. In. That's okay. He recently was on uh, a podcast, and he was and he was he was asked about it, and it came up. He said, "I can't hate her anymore, but he will not read Jessica Simpson's her memoir book, Open It, because he Open Book, excuse me, because he lived it. I was going to say was he there, lived it. Yeah, through it. Yes, he says he doesn't need another person's point of view of what." happened what he knows happened so he says quote you'll be shocked to hear that i have not nor will i ever read it they were married from 2002 to 2006 it only lasted like four years again they're both remarried gone on their separate ways um and I'm, she also has a movie coming out with amazon about her life story they're mm -hmm. calling it to, they're going to bring it to a small screen near you pretty soon so obviously he's just he's saying that you know she's not he she is not on his radar he has moved on with his life he has yeah. his family his kids mm -hmm. and he's just not worried about it we which that. he's I just, entitled to that I just other think fans if, can indulge you know i just think if i'm vanessa lachey i'm like yeah you don't need to read it 
Like, Absolutely. move on. We're, we're married. She's married. It's all good. Jay Cruz, good to see you. Thank you, Appreciate as always, for the entertainment news update. And we'll remind everybody it's Jay Cruz on air is his website, and then you can find him on social media at Jay Cruz That could be our air. morning after express question of the day. If your huh. ex were to write a book about your relationship, would you read it? <laughs> Secretly. Probably wouldn't tell you guys about uh, it. Uh, <laughs>